Are you tired of your 9 to 5 job? You honestly feel like there's no sense of purpose, like there's no purpose in life. You honestly tried everything. You tried drinking coffee, you tried going out on a run in the morning, in the evening, you probably also tried yoga. Then, here's a good news for you. Miracle Mentality, every morning, a devotion just made for you with Pastor Jolly John so that you can have some sense of purpose in life, just like me. Praise the Lord. This is the day that the Lord has made. And you are a victorious person today because God has made you as a victorious person. So Matthew chapter 7, verse 24, we read like this. Whoever hears these sayings of mine and doeth them, I will liken him unto a wise man which built his house upon a rock. These are the words of Jesus. He's speaking, he's saying that whoever heareth my word and whoever does my word, I will like him because he's like a wise man who built the house upon a rock. We hear many times we teach our children building the house upon the sand and house upon the rock. And we teach in Sunday school and we teach in VBS, all those things, the stories and the songs about the wise men and the foolish men. But today my question is, what about us? What about you? Is you are building your house upon the solid rock called Jesus Christ? Is your foundation is upon the cornerstone called Jesus Christ? Is your foundation upon a solid rock? That rock which won't move, it won't be shattered, it is an unmovable, adamant rock. You listen to the word of God and you do the word of God, definitely you will be like a wise man who built the house upon the rock. In every area of our lives, we need to keep reading the Bible. We need to keep applying these principles in our lives our lives, these keys in our lives and we will be like a wise man who built a house upon the rock. This morning I pray that you will give more time to dig for digging deeper into the word of God, to understand and apply the principles in your lives. When you understand that the Lord is my shepherd and I shall not lack anything. And when you apply those words in your life, definitely you won't lack anything. When you understand that Jehovah Jireh is my provider, definitely He became your provider. When you understand that Jehovah Rapha is the healer, He became your healer. You will understand Him more. You apply, you, you recite, you remember, you recollect all the words which you read in the times of your need. And that will help you to move forward and upward and by standing on a solid rock called Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Shall we pray? Father, we thank you and we praise you. Jesus, we thank you because you are our solid rock. Help us to build our houses on the solid rock. So that we won't move because you are an adamant rock. You are an adamant rock. Lord, you are the cornerstone of our lives. We thank you for that. Thank you for that solid foundation. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you. Thank you, Father. Thank you for loving us this much. Thank you for caring for us this much, Lord. Thank you. Today morning I pray that all of your children, those who are looking for the solutions and the answers, Lord, help them to dig deeper into your word, Lord, so that they'll find answers and solutions and they will build their house upon a rock called Jesus. We thank you and we praise you. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Amen. Have a blessed day.